queen for a little guy. Oh my god, she's gonna fight you, bro. He's gonna fight you. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, earlier, I was like I said, I'm glad I didn't just open up Twitter earlier at the beginning of stream because the first thing I saw is a Twitch streamer that I follow streaming on kick fully nude with one of those dildo machines. Bro, you guys know me. I'm no Puritan, okay? I'm no conservative. I love porn. I think porn's great. Um, I think porn is a staple in any healthy functioning society. Porn is moral, but broadcasting porn live to an underage audience is not only weird and problematic, but it's fucking illegal. That's, that's Dan Dangler, exactly, exactly. But wait, did she do that? Okay, what I wanna know is, was that on Kick or was she doing that on Twitch? Where was she doing that? It was on Kick, right? But, like, I, Sizzle, I, like, agree in the sense that, like, I have nothing wrong with that shit. Except for the fact that, like, once you start broadcasting it, like live porn to an underage audience it's illegal like and i if for good reason like that's weird that's just weird i'm not saying that those people are like trying to market themselves to underage like like they're not trying to be like oh i i love that there's these underage kids watching me i'm not accusing them of that at all but it's just still it's just fucking weird to like be like oh i know that i have this huge underage audience that's gonna watch me and I'm gonna fucking do porn. Kick becoming a campsite gup gray f stare. I mean, I think that's what it it's gonna be. I I like cause I saw Corinna Comp is going over there. Now uh we saw Aiden Ross is going over there, but I don't think it's exclusive. I have a feeling we're gonna see Aiden Ross streaming on both websites. Um maybe not. I could be wrong about that, but I would I do if I am wrong about that, I think that in a couple months. They're, they'll all just be back on, on Twitch. Um, wait, Aiden Ross still went live on Twitch today? See, okay. Proving me right already. I literally was just like, I might be wrong. But. What up, highlighted? Love you too, bro. But, um... I just, I'm... The way I look at Kick is like... Yeah, it's run by Stake, which is like a really... they uh, 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 offsh Offshore crypto gambling website that's made a ton of money, I'm sure. But... If Microsoft couldn't even keep their live streaming platform afloat, I just don't see how a website like Kick is gonna be able to do it for long term. While they're also like paying streamers a bunch of money to come over. But they're not paying streamers what like Kick, uh, what Mixer was. Like um, with Microsoft, like they were giving Shroud and, and Ninja like 20 million, like million dollar deals. Like multi-million dollar deals where it's like i don't think that's what's going on with aiden and karina and and other people on kick maybe but i just i don't think that they're getting offered that much i don't think a website like kick can do that like is kick a gambling website making more money than microsoft i don't know i don't know we'll see though we'll see i uh i like you guys know me i'm all about having a healthy competitor for twitch i hope that I always I was hoping YouTube gaming would become that, you know, it just didn't and I don't think it's going to But uh, because there is a really good conversation to be had here about Kick paying their streamers more The 70 30 split isn't it or is it more on kick? I forget but That needs to go on here you take some chocolate and some lobster and some eggs and some pie. Yeah. You mix it in your body and shit it all out, cat jam. It's 95 and 5%. See, that to me, like, I just don't... That, like, is amazing and I love the idea of that. I just don't see how that's going to work out for them long term. Like, I don't see how they're going to be able to keep funding themselves. Maybe, though. Because, like, Mixer couldn't even do it. But... And like Twitch does because we're owned by Amazon. Like that, like we're, we literally, our servers are hosted by Amazon services. Like our streams play on Amazon servers. Whereas Pick is using those same servers. But 
I think the conver the really good conversation to be had here isn't like, oh yeah, let's go over to Kick to have no TOS and be streaming with fucking Nazis and people doing porn to the minors. But let's get Twitch to go back to 70-30 at least. Like, I think if enough streamers start being like, oh yeah, we're leaving, we're going, Twitch might go back to 70-30 split, especially now in these past few months when ad revenue is down. All those crazy ad revenue deals that streamers were getting four or five months ago, not even. I myself, when I had my ads turned on to max, I was getting like $50 a month in just playing advertisements on stream. I was like, what the fuck is going on? Whereas before I would make like $2 a month, if that. But now I'm back down in ads to making like $2 a month. And that most streamers that were getting like $40,000 for playing this many advertisements, that's gone. And the whole reason why Twitch got rid of the 70-30 was that. They justified it with that. Like, oh, no more 70-30, but you can monetize way more with advertisements. Which, that's just Twitch shooting themselves in the foot. It's That's killing viewership. Um, but... I think that is the main conversation that could be had here that's like, yo, let's push for that. Let's let's get Twitch to go back to the 70 30 Because it's like, bro, some of these streamers, it's just ridiculous that half of the income that they're making, that street that their chat is paying them. Like, say like the chat is like paying them forty thousand dollars in subs a month and they're only getting twenty. That's bullshit. It's bullshit. It shouldn't be like that. So I hope that all these bigger streamers that are like making tweets like Asmongold the other day when he did that that clip about talking about, oh, it's better to go over to kick. Why wouldn't you? And then at the end of the clip, like I said, like I said in the beginning, it's all about money. He was like, oh, hey, Twitch, if you pay me enough, I'll stay. I don't think Asmongold has any thoughts of moving, but him just saying that, oh, I'll stay if you pay me more. That's him just trying to pivot them into being like, oh, here, let's offer him some money. He's just trying to get them to do that. So hopefully the more people that start being like, yeah, we need that 70-30. This is ridiculous. Hopefully that happens. Um, but it's just like I, the, the whole beginning of this conversation. It's so crazy to me that Dan Dangler was doing that. It, it was on kick though, right? Um, it's basically his intro screen to kick. Okay, train. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I had three emails from Kick today from Train going live. I was like, how do I stop this? I had three different emails where like, Train went live and they were all within like 30 minutes of each other. People saying he went live, okay. But, um. I, I agree. I agree. Uh, Twitch is my main source of entertainment, Mr. Busket. I don't watch anything else, really. I watch YouTube with you guys on stream, and sometimes I watch like certain videos if I'm trying to learn something off stream, but for the most part, I end stream and I turn on NMP stream, or I watch Hassan when he goes live. I, I watch my favorite streamers. That's my entertainment. I have no desire to go watch like a new Netflix series. I just, I want to watch Twitch. And uh, I think, the, like I said, the only way that the creators on Twitch are ever going to have any power is if there is another competitor. I just like kick just doesn't have the TOS for me to be like, yep, that's a viable option right now. Yeah, Bezos is definitely rich enough, Sizzle. I agree. Um, yep, I agree. 50-50 is dumb. 100%. Yeah, I have access to streaming services. I just don't watch this stuff. I prefer live improvised content over like uh, shows. Unless it's a show like Breaking Bad or something like that, where it's like, oh my God, this is something I need to see because I enjoy it so much. But even then, there's shows like that, like Game of Thrones, where I just totally skipped out on it and I never watched, so. Ooh, highlighted, you got a bad headache, man? You gonna, you gonna hit some ganj? You gonna take a couple puffs? See if it gets rid of it. That sometimes helps me, not always. It all out. 
game day. Okay, we're going to watch OTK game day here in a minute. But I think before we watch that, we'll go over the Twitch stuff. Because I guess there's there, these streamer TV videos seem interesting. Cutie Cinderella spent 900k on streamer awards. That's insane. Dante's blacklisted from streamer awards. I want to know about that. New classes to expect in Dark and Darker. Dizzle sent me this. I had uh, already seen the tweet when he sent it to me, I think. I actually, I hadn't checked Discord when I retweeted it, so you might have sent it to me at like the same time. But, uh, Dark and Darker, next playtest, April 14th to the 19th. And then hopefully early access in like May. Hopefully. A lot of people were saying that uh, early access was going to come at the end of April, early May. But I heard after this tweet came out that Iron Mace Games wanted needed another playtest before they do early access, they said. So, we'll do this playtest. And honestly, look at the dates. April 14th to the 19th. You, think, you don't think they're going to extend that into the 420? Come on. Of course they know that we're all going to want to get ripped as shit on 420 and go into the dungeons. And get one-shotted by a cave troll. Let's go. They, they, they have to. It, they, it would be illegal, in my opinion, if they end the Dark and Darker playtest on the 19th and don't extend it at least onto 420. That would be a crime against humanity. Okay? Dark and Darker is one of the few things I look forward to in life now. Please, just give it to me on 420. Please. But yeah. Oh, you don't have any highlighted? Fuck. Maybe that's why you have a headache. Maybe that's why. I've definitely gotten headaches when I don't smoke sometimes. But it's more just like, fuck, I want to smoke really bad. I remember the days of before recreational and medical marijuana. And you'd hit up your friend and they'd be like, oh, bro, I'm out for a week. I remember the moment I got my medical card back in like 2015 or 16. I was like, never again. Never again will I have to go through that. Ever in my life. Unless I'm broke. Then, then yeah. Think you're still 2020, but agreed. So, did you get a medical card, or did you just wait till it was recreational for you? Because I got a medical card like two or two years before it became legal. Because I, di I didn't even know it was gonna go recreational. I just like I needed that medical card. Oh, dude! Oh shit! You're over in Ohio, bro. How are you doing with everything? Are you uh, are you in an area where you're like highly affected by the 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 chemical spill? We've, we've talked about that a little bit on the other side okay so have you been affected by it at all could you see any like clouds of like crazy chemical smoke or anything is you like are they telling you to like boil your water or like buy bottled water or anything like that or are you just chilling no okay that's that's lucky good for you man Good for you. I'm happy. I'm happy you're not affected by it. Um, oh, we saw this yesterday. Okay, let's get into Twitch clips. Let's see what's going on. Check out uh, Twitch unless there's any other personal news to share. The f oh, does anybody need to know about the Factor sponsorship that I'm doing on Monday? Anybody need information on that? here actually real quick i want to edit something because in the announcement i said that they were microwavable slash oven ready meals but i should i should call them like meal preps because they're not like frozen meals they send them to you and you put them in your fridge i'm sure you could put it in your freezer if you want but they're more like instead of being frozen meals they're like meal preps but um if anybody needs any info on this 
say something right now, I'll go over it. If not, the announcement is in the Discord. Here, I'm gonna delete this just so it's the most recent one. If it's something you're interested in, go hit this React right here, please. Just react on the announcement in the Discord, because it'll let me know who's interested in, so I can decide if I'm for sure gonna do it. But I think I am regardless. Because even if I get like three or four signups, it's really gonna help me out. Like extremely. And so there's four people here, and then I have like a couple people outside of like my family members that are gonna try it out. So hopefully these hopefully the four people that said it want it. Um, it's a really good deal. It's it's it oh shit, you guys can't see me. It's different than most uh sponsorships we've done, like the Raid Shadow Legends one, where it's literally just you download the game and you play it and then I get paid. This one, it's requires you to subscribe, but the only reason why I would do a, one like this is because it's a good deal. Like the the amount of money you're paying for these meals, anybody that budgets their meals out for a week for, or for the month will look at these prices and be like, oh, this is nice. And same thing with the HelloFresh deal. It's just, uh, that's the only reason why I'm doing it. I've gotten other offers, like really good offers. Like there's one I have from a company called Babbel where it's, and this one's good too, honestly. This is another good one where it's not just like, oh, you have to subscribe to some shitty thing for me. It's something that could benefit you if you wanted it. It's a uh, uh, Babbel, it's a, um, uh, a language service where you could go and learn different languages online. And they, they offered me a really good deal. But this one is the one I'd, I'd, I'd rather do the food one because this is like directly beneficial to you guys. Like, you buy the food and you're gonna eat it. You're not gonna like buy a subscription to a, a language website and then be like, oh, I'll get to that next week. And then by the time your subscription ends, you're like, oh, I didn't do any of that. Fuck. That, that was a waste. This won't end up being a waste unless you just don't eat the food. But, uh, but yeah, this, if I, if this does well, I'm buying myself a graphics card. Like if I make enough money, I'm going to buy a graphics card with it. And uh, if I, if I make enough, because what they're offering me, if we if, uh, we would never sell this many, but if I m reached the 50 subscription limit that I have, I would be set for like the next year, like even longer than that. Like it, it's like face rug hooking me up times more than that. Um, but I would if if we did that, if I like even reached like 20 subscriptions, I'm gonna buy a whole new PC. And I'm going to take this PC, put it in the kitchen, and we're going to have kitchen streams. But, uh, so I'm hoping that this goes well on Monday. We're just going to start it, and it's not anything where I have to, like, go out and cook. Because they're, they're ready-made meals that you just, like, microwave. So, we're just going to be sitting here. We'll probably watch a couple Factor Meals videos just to look at the food. Maybe we'll watch a couple things, but it'll just be like a normal stream just with Factor up in the corner and it'll show the, the progress of who's subscribed and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, sponsorships like this are cool because... Well, no, it's did not. I'm not going to say that because it's different. It's not like Raid Shadow Legends at all. It's different. Never mind. Um, sucks for those. Oh, it's horrible. Um, I love how Trump policy could have caused it. Oh, I mean, Trump, li that's the funny thing, is it's a huge L for Joe Biden. He looks like a fucking idiot, dude. This week going over to Ukraine and giving a speech over there, but not even making a stop in Ohio? What a fucking dumbass, dude. So stupid. Because like what you said, I think that's what you were saying, like Trump like did so much deregulation during his four years, like specifically did like deregulation to like the railways and things like that. And it's not, it wasn't just him, like these companies are greedy on their own. Like they, they do their own uh, like uh, cutting corners, uh, firing safety teams. Down firing. in Ohio, swag like Ohio. Yeah, yes, yeah, swag like Ohio, exactly. But like it's it, it it's not just Trump's deregulation. It's these companies that like literally don't give a fuck about uh, the safety measures or anything like that. Uh, stopping unions, uh, um, firing their safety teams, just firing all their employees, stuff like that. Cutting corners wherever they can so they can increase their own individual capital. Lobbying exactly. But goddamn, 
it, even though it was Trump's deregulation, he goes down there, he goes to a McDonald's, starts buying them McDonald's. I'm seeing people go and be interviewed now wearing Trump flags as blankets. Dude. It's the same shit. Like with what Hillary did back in 2016. Hillary, did you go to Pennsylvania? Did you go to Ohio and talk to those people in the Midwest? No. She didn't stop at those places fucking once during her campaign. And that's why Trump won those places. <laughs> Duh. He was the one that cared about him. They, like, he, like, I don't blame them. I literally don't even blame them for voting for Trump. Because, like, like we, we saw that one clip yesterday and we talked about it. Like, of course, not everybody that voted for Trump is, like, a racist bigot. Like, a majority of them probably aren't. It's just he has, like, a very vocal base that really love him and agree with everything he says. But most of the people just saw Trump versus Hillary and they're like, oh, there's one guy that cares about us and she's the corporate candidate. We're not voting for her. So many of those people, because I told you, I volunteered for the Bernie campaign to both times. They told me, they're like, oh, I would have voted for Bernie over Trump, but uh, I was not voting for Hillary. Some of that might have been sexism, but I think a lot of it is literally just because she was the uh, she was the corporate candidate that did not do anything to prove that she cared about the working class throughout her her campaign. That's it. Anytime she was even criticized on that, she would like double down and like talk about how she only cared about like rich donors. It was fucked up. Same, Mr. Busket. Same. Same with me. I've never donated to anybody else. Feel like you're living in a state of morons. Yep. And I mean, some of them are, but like I said, some of and I even the people that got tricked. That were like, oh, Trump cares about us. Like, you got duped. You got debated. Kind of dumb. But, like, I understand where they're coming from. When it's like you're pitted against, like, Hillary. Like, I, I saw the lesser of two evils there. But even then, it's like, had Hillary become president? We might have ended up actually, like, in war with Iran. Like, because she's been talking about going to war with Iran for, like, 20 years now. So, like, it, who knows? Who knows? But I've I voted for what I thought was the lesser of two evils, but I like understand why a lot of people voted for Trump, like for sure, just because he was the one that shook, at least pretended to care about them. And like we were, I've been saying, like anytime we talk about this, he's literally started to steal Bernie's rhetoric from Bernie's campaign and say it as if it was his own. He didn't believe any of it, but he he knew what Bernie had. He, he knew how smart Bernie was. And not smart, Bernie's not smart, it's like Bernie's like calculated. He just knew that Bernie had the right ideas when it came to the working class. And if he adopted those and said them to everybody, they would fall for hook, line, and sinker. Um, Cause like, literally, Bernie was the one that was like anti-NAFTA, like these trade deals that take jobs away from America and send them overseas. TPP, the new one that they were working on. Um, Bernie was always against those. Talked about how he was going to get rid of those and bring jobs back to America, make working lives better here. Hillary Clinton was, oh no, NAFTA's great. We just need to renegotiate it a little bit and make it a little better. These liberal policy, we just need to keep them going. Trump was like, oh no, NAFTA, fuck that. He didn't care. <laughs> he didn't really care. They, he just made like a new NAFTA that was like a little bit more beneficial to the to, to the CEOs. But at least during his campaign, he went out there and was like, yeah, I'm against NAFTA like Bernie. Hillary didn't do that. He was pro-NAFTA. It's just... Uh, so dumb. Yeah, oh yeah. He, and he probably even said that. He probably even said that he would. But like I said, they all got you baited. Um, he lost a lot of support. Oh, are you saying Trump lost a lot of support on January 6th? I, I would imagine. I mean, I, he lost a lot of support amongst, uh, especially, like, not his base, but amongst the, like, Lincoln Republicans, the ones that are, like, the Liz Cheney's and stuff. They already didn't respect him at all, the Lincoln Republicans, but, like, that was when they had, like, an actual, like, oh, here, we can actually be against him now. Like, we can, like, do something about this. 
but uh but yeah kill uh kelvin in sons of the forest i really hope we can even play sons of the forest sizzle i really hope we're even able to play that but if we do i'm calling him brian is your PC bad off? I just, yesterday, opening up Sons of the Forest, I was getting crazy encoding errors. And I got it to a point to where it was playing okay, except when I would be swimming in the water, like looking toward like the big mountain in the distance, everything on my stream just starts to lag. But I think I got it to where I can play it for the most part. We're gonna try it in a little bit. But my, I think it's just, it's either that it's unoptimized or my graphics card is just going out, but I play other games and I don't have this issue. Like, I know Atomic Heart isn't a big open world, but, like, I play Atomic Heart on, like, high and ultra settings and I don't have any issues. Oh, shit, I'm sorry that this song has just, like, been replaying for, like, ten minutes. <laughs> my bad. Yeah. Atomic is Unreal Fire. Okay, I didn't know that. But yeah, like, I play Atomic Heart and I have no issues. But I open up Sons of the Forest and I, it's like not even playable at first. Once I turned most of the stuff down to like low and medium and certain things off, it worked okay. And I did a couple extra things in my settings. Like in my task manager, I set OBS to high priority. Did a couple things that I thought maybe will help. So we'll see. We'll see. But, um, yeah, I want to play it. I really wanted to. I, that's all I wanted to play yesterday, but it just didn't work out. So, we'll see. But, all right, let's get into, let's get into watching some uh, Twitch clips. Let's see what happened on Twitch today. Aiden Ross moving to kick. We know about this. He's already streamed on Twitch since then. But that's, that, I'm really glad you told me that, Mr. Busket, because I didn't even know that he had streamed on Twitch today. But, like, yeah, it's... It, it proves my point. It's not exclusive. They're going to be streaming on both platforms. Aiden Ross announces his official platform switch to kick. You ready to go, Aiden? Where's the powder? Powder? What are you talking about? So what's new? What's, what's, what's going on this year? Uh, you know me, man. I've just been living life. Uh, I've been really trying to figure out my stream. What the prices have you taken advice from? Uh, actually, my mom. You know me and my mom, we what? lots. Yeah. Oh, no, she. Oh, what, what, what's, what's the major reason oh, in your decision? Elbows. How's I mean, the, uh, how's the new bike? It's not like you athlete. Athletes. Look at this fat ass, man. All right, bro, chill out. You know me, man. I, I just want to win. Man, so. can you shut your ass up? You egghead ass. You ain't winning. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get to the point. This is, uh, this is tough. Uh, I, I just want to win. I, I, I decided to take. I, I decided I want to take my talents. Well, there you have it, folks. Thanks for joining us. Ada wants to win. Damn. I love how they don't even mention kick. Don't you want to know where I'm streaming? Yo. Like they, I think they write it here, yeah. But like he does, they don't even mention kick Destiny once. Destiny isn't racist. Destiny is. We saw this clip yesterday. I'm gonna just the 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 context. Your rage gaming is trying to band together with Destiny, so they can, he can win uh, just chatting streamer of the year. He think your rage thinks. If I get all of DGG to vote for me, we'll be able to beat Hassan. And I love your rage, but that's cringe as fuck. Edgy. Aligning with somebody like Destiny, cringe, dude. He is insensitive sometimes. <laughs> he, is. he is insensitive sometimes. He is edgy. Is He does not understand black culture whatsoever. He's not in tune. Get in tune, my Like, come on. We, we lit out this motherfucker. Uh, all of the above. But I do not think he's racist. You just I don't do know Destiny. Your rage. You don't know him. That is that. But no, I, mean, I don't think Destiny is fully racist either. We talked about this yesterday. I don't think he I'd be a sees people be and hates them because be like, of the, the color of their yeah, skin. Yeah, he's racist just because I'm afraid of what the f But he knows what he's doing when a couple weeks ago, Destiny was like, these loud black streamers are so annoying on Twitch. Like, that's just a racist thing to say. <laughs> that is. My community going to say, I don't give a It's hatching. This egg is hatching. This clip was crazy yesterday. Actually, jabated me. I was literally jabated by this clip yesterday. <laughs> so 
Toast interrupts the moment of silence. Still not. Before we begin, we wanted to pay our respects to all those impacted by Turkey as well as Syria and the earthquake well, for the moment. No no sad. No. And it's also nice because one of the biggest problem I have is getting my partner wet. Wait, 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 wait. That's not going to be a problem with wait, wait, they're doing a moment of silence, Toast. Wait, doing right moment during silence. the moment oh, of so silence. Sorry. Way to go, Toast. Hey, Toast, talk to Ben Shapiro. He has a, that has same issue. He's spent for the stream reward so far. Yeah, did I tell you how much I was spending on it? You don't have to tell them. Yeah. No, I might have told them. That's why I'm asking. 300k was last year. Oh, guys, it's more. It's more. I'm at 900k. <laughs> no! XQC gets confused. That's crazy. That's insane. He ripped a wheelie on accident. My dad was so happy about it. I'm grounded from my bike. Bro, oh, bro, get them rip, dude. Sky is VOD or daily rip. stream? Which one is it? Nick restarts. Goes we saw that clip yesterday. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I gotta see him scream like that again. That was great. Or daily kick stream. Which one is it? Nick restarts. Goes as planned. <laughs> oh, we just gotta restart. We gotta restart. We gotta restart. We gotta restart. I took damage. Okay, cool, cool, Elvis. I took damage that I shouldn't have taken. How do we restart? I I, I did not know that guy was going to be. He scared the f me. He scared the f me. Now I know he's going to be coming. Okay, got it. Now he knows. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, sh <laughs> Another guy. There we go. Got to restart again. Love Street Fighter. Dude, I actually love Street Fighter. I wish I was good at Street Fighter because I love Street Fighter. I love all those old fight. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Guys, I love Street Fighter. <laughs> I love Street Fighter. Toxic player tells female streamer Dead or alive that volleyball is a man's game. Gets karma in two minutes. Are you a homosexual? No. Suicide squad footage? No, huh? -uh. Are you a woman? Yes. Oh, even worse. Well, uh, yeah, I know. Imagine. You have no play. You have no no right to play this game. This game is for men. Okay. Okay, is that guy being like sarcastic? I can't tell. Even if he is, like, that's like, it, even if you're a dude that's like doesn't believe that shit, and you're just saying it as like a joke, like most women don't want to hear that. They don't think it's funny. Yeah, that's cool and all. Hey, I heard you were a homo. Get wrecked. What up, Bodie? All right, we we, we uh, ma'am, are you still in here? We killed the guy that was talking to you, by the way. Uh, yeah, I am still in here. Oh well yeah, okay, yeah. Legend shots, bro. That's fucking Vinny from the chain gang. Yo, what a legend. Oh, God, I love Vinny. I knew there was a reason I always love Vinny. I always loved him. <laughs> fucking shots, dude. What a legend. Toxic player tells female streamer that Tarkov is a man's game. Gets karma. Dude, I got to see hear this again. You do, Bodie? No. Send me some pics in the DM. I'll be the judge woman? of that. Yes. Oh, even worse. Well, uh, yeah, I know. Imagine. You have no play. You have no no right to play this game. This game is for men. Okay. Yeah, that's cool and all. Hey, I heard you were a homo. It sounded like he was about to say uh, we, we, uh, man, some bigotry. We killed a guy that it sounded was like he was about to say a slur. Uh, yeah, I am still in here. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, oh that's what you mean, yourself. Bodie. You oh, I thought you meant like you just hadn't taken a shower we'll or something. You were, you were feeling dude. gross. Bodie, to kill that I don't guy even notice that shit. I appreciate that man. a lot, actually. You, do you want all the loot from all these guys and I'll just leave? Because I don't... No, no, we'll you okay, one. yeah, I'll that's what I was saying. I was like, you're sexy beast, bro. I'm one second. That's what I was saying. Send me the DMs. So I can be the judge for myself. There you go. We're here. Hi. Hey, what's going on? What's up? Douchebag, I was just waiting for my Six boy to come months? so I could kill him quick and just to get you out of here. I appreciate that. My hand. Man, my last stream was gonna be tomorrow, bro. Tomorrow is gonna be my last stream. Fuck. Now I'm here for six more months. Shit.
I was gonna do the factor sponsorship next week and then say peace. Yes, yes. Ben, thank you. There you go, Bodie. Now you're, now you're good. Now you're even sexier than you were, which I didn't think was possible. I didn't think that was possible. Apparently, it is. Oh wait, what? Uh, where were we? Aiden Ross and here. This is the clip we were on. There you go. So legendary that Vinny shots from the Chan Gang was able to come in and save, save this clip. We're here. Hi. Hey, what's going on? What's, yeah, what's sorry up? for that douchebag. I was just waiting for my boy to come so we could kill him quick and just to get you out of here. I appreciate that. My hands are Bro. like actually shaking after that, so thank you. Yep, well, Bro. that's why we came. We're here. We got out, we got out shining up. Tech time. What? Tech so I want to know, idea? are they friends? Like, does she do GTA roleplay and they know each other? Or was that just a random encounter where shots were just being a fucking great dude? For my friend Joe, shout out to Joe. That Fred. is fu that um, is so dope that that happened. You came in. I was staying at your house. Good for him and, and her. We, man. <laughs> we were doing Fuck a New Year's loser. quiz, and you came in and walked in, and and we were guessing this what is literal this? game. He does this game show every uh, oh, emo only. This is Tectone's new game show. Okay. New Year's, right? He does a New Year's thing, and <laughs> you came in. Wait, no, what you like say? The stupidest thing I've ever seen. And then you walked out no. of the. <laughs> Oh, that you've lost okay, hello yeah, Nice, dude. <laughs> oh, what you doing? What uh, what you regiment you on? To act out the emotes and chat is going to have to guess which emote you are doing properly. There's a video. There's a game that does this. You stole it from them. <laughs> Everything you're doing is stolen from something else. <laughs> I'm which just gonna one? throw it out there. Game late. So to just calling it speechless. out. We recruited characters from Chainsaw Man into our party. Okay, I think we saw this clip too. That's pretty much what's going on. Okay. I get it. But what are that, we going to do? You know, Bodhi, there, there you go. I think that's like the no, biggest Marina, thing we're not doing is that. like uh, just cut, reducing Wait, your calorie intake. Cute. Not not to a point where you're not getting what, what is, you need, what but on? like just, uh, you know, I, I think that's the way, bro. What? How do? Hang on. Yeah, W Bodie. There's ramen. He's still in 160p ramen. Shopaholics always end up on top. Actually, this would make a killer live stream. Look at Milena, bro. I think we might play this game. We if you might enjoy this video, that. feel free to drop a like. And if you want to keep up with the latest news and clips, be sure to subscribe and turn notifications on. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Kai gives a subs to a small streamer. Oh, 
would he do it? A girl jerking him off. A girl was just jerking him off, bro. Cut it out. Yo! Yo! Oh, oh, this game. Mr. Buskey. I forget what it's called. But NMP and Milena were playing it. I forget what it's called. They had they ha it's on NMP's uh about me. Like a link to download it. It's not on Steam. But it's this uh, anime beautiful anime game. Kept buffering, really? Is it good now? Ooh, Bodhi, you gonna hit that workout? Ooh, let's go. But uh, here, I wanna watch this <gasps> clip again. Oh, send it. Yeah, Bodhi, send it. I'll watch it right now. See, this would be me, except even more. Like, I wouldn't be like, oh, he Kai just got caught jerking off. I'd be like, oh, what happened with that whole, like, situation with your friend being a piece of shit? Like, I would literally do that. Yo! <laughs> Yo! I would, I, that would be me. Because I got the 100 oh, subs. You can't refund it at that point. I'm like, what happened to your friend being like a piece of shit and you like covering for it, bro? What happened with that? That's me. Whereas some people would just be like, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm out here being like, yeah, let me, let me ruin my, let me burn this bridge right off the bat. But some bridges I just don't want, you know? Um, What's up, guys? Streamer TV and first up in the news, we have now, Dante's. Like now you can find him mostly yesterday. playing Damn. at League of Legends and that in sucks. the just chatting section. Today, the streamer went live to be told that he's not allowed to attend the streamer award. Here, Bodhi, did you send it to me? We'll pull it up. Joe, what's yeah. everything you take? Everything. Everything. That was well, sexual. Most of, no. it, most no, of it is like the, the big results Everyone. come from. We're watching that that clip in a little bit. Okay, wait, no, you didn't send it yet, I don't think. Let me know when that comes in. Oh, you put it, oh no, here, I'll, I'll just pull it up there. Perfect. Just pull it up there. Okay, here. And... That long walk home, my car broke down. It's just no plows were out. You so did it really? Road home. <laughs> Whoa. What was Willie Gwiggy on a frozen <laughs> road? <laughs> Wait, are you shirtless, bro? Oh my god. I can't I can't tell if there's a shirt on or not. And that long walk home, my car broke down. Two versions? And okay, well, watch. I want to see this one again. Long walk home, on. my car broke down. It's just no plows were out, so I had a clear road home. <laughs> Whoa! What was Willie? Just hitting a quick Are frosty gritty, real road? quick. <laughs> just the, the frosty gritty. Oh, it's just snow plows were out, so I had a fucking clear road to walk on home because my car broke down. Did, did the car really break down? Who was Willie? Willie on a frozen road, naked. <laughs> No, oh, there we go. Oh, there you can really see it. There we go. I like that. Whoa. I'm gonna have to save this Whoa, video. Who is Woody on the frozen road naked? <laughs> can I save it. Oh yeah, just download it, right? All right, cool. Thank you. Um, all right, let's go back well, to this. Because many people have been complaining about this streamer and what he's done in the past. If you guys want to watch the clip for more content. Okay, wait, I tried brushing this off and I know people like this will still exist, but if it could maybe stop even a few people from doing this in the future for them to know this is not okay, that's all I want. Uh, also, it's not about testing people's honesty, it's sexual harassment. What happened? What did this Context, guy do? The link is in the description and share your thoughts in the comment section and the streamer awards just chatting section. First up in the news, we have Dante's. Now you can find him mostly playing at League of Legends and in no, the just chatting section. No, a car didn't section. break Today, down that was literally in my driveway, basically. Okay, okay, cool. Love to be told that he's not allowed to attend the streamer awards because many people have been complaining about this streamer and what he's done in the past. If you guys want to watch the clip for more context, the link is in the description and share your thoughts in the comment section below. I didn't think I was going to go at first, but I thought that maybe there might be a possibility that I would. But then um, someone told me that apparently there were... 
I guess like people sending in complaints uh, that I was even like nominated in the first place. So I was asked to not attend. Let's just say that. But it's okay. There's always next year. Corinna is moving to kick.com. I don't want to go, go next year. It's, but damn, I wonder. I, I have no idea what that guy did. Or everyone anything. else is. Uh, no everyone's clue. leaving. Everyone's leaving here for somewhere else. If you know what I'm talking about. She's still gonna be streaming on Twitch. Okay. Just, in your Just Snapchat? like Mr. Busket was saying with Aiden yeah. today. I've been posting on Snapchat. It's gonna be. It's gonna be their intro into their kick stream. A lot. Um, David got me into doing that, and I've been posting a ton on Snapchat. Like. I mean, a lot for me. So I post there regularly. Hey, you won. I've been and trying I to bring know. Snapchat hey, Europeans, back. you know what that is? She's not just doing that for fun. Air conditioning. <laughs> hey, Nick, you're in a hospital. Wait, you were sick? You oh, you still had COVID, buddy? Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> yo what did she say? Without paying $10,000. Yo, yo. <laughs> Europeans, you know what that is? Air conditioning. <laughs> hey Nick, you're in a hospital. You ever been there without paying ten thousand dollars? Yo yo <laughs> yo yo. <laughs> See ya, the <Nicole>. True. True. <laughs> <Roo. laughs> Rich most Americans can't even afford to go into a hospital. Okay. Quit, <laughs> Oh, Booney. Booney's culture being Stop represented. Extra Emily using a treadmill. It's, well, we, we call it sturdy. This is sturdy, right? I would say so. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a cartoon. She literally looks like <laughs> a cartoon. <laughs> yeah, you look like an overconfident cartoon character that, like, has a special spell, and they're gonna, it's like Timmy oh, Turner okay. going to, like, ace a test, but then realizing there was, like, a trick. No. You guys get it from each other, and making out? Test, and then you start walking, like, that's what it sounds like, Booney. Real shuffled, yeah. And that's that's after. Asmund Gold on subreddit. Let's be criticized Let's go, on buddy. the internet. Like you should be able to criticize a person and say, I don't agree with what this person is saying. But the problem is that in a lot of these subreddits, it's not I don't agree with what this person is saying. It's this person is a piece of shit. I hope they they're worthless, they do nothing for society, I hate them, and I hope everything bad that could ever happen to them does happen to them. Yeah, see, that's and not what... saying stuff yesterday like Yesterday when I criticized his take, uh, what was his take on, on, oh, the 39 daft stuff? Uh, I didn't say anything. And like having I said an entire dumb. community of people <laughs> that's stupid. built around that level of vitriol, Equating, I don't like, view as healthy. To the I don't view this as healthy way. for that's the website. Ridiculous. I don't view this as healthy for even the people who are... Who are Falls and breaks but... every game, now AI. Uh, like, I'm not now? out here saying Asagold's <laughs> a piece of shit that needs to die. To gaming. <laughs> I'm the god gamer for a reason. And, uh, I only say that about Nazis. For this crap. Or, uh, so I, uh, whatever. <laughs> So much I could just break. But even then, they can be reformed. Some, not, not very rare. I'm sorry, force it. <clears throat> okay, I'm Total good. I'm good on the AI stuff sandwiches. now. It's, it was funny game. at first. You're in a rank game. Rank game. Okay. Your team is giving you, okay. right? Freak is on the enemy team, We're and you got a win trigger on your team. Okay. Well, what are you gonna do? Are you gonna go top, which is one? Are you gonna go bot, which is three? No, you're gonna run it the f down mid. You're gonna choose two. Two is in the middle. You're gonna straight run it down. Why? Because you want. I don't know. I might go for three. I might go for three. That's a bigger bite. End the game quickly, right? You want to end the sandwich quickly. Yeah, don't go on two hand sandwich eaters. Everybody who's like two hands, by the way, I use two hands. This is how I see you guys. Is this you guys? <laughs> is this chat? Are you small, feeble toddler children? Holding it with two hands? Is this how you eat a sandwich? Yeah! Because every single, every person that's, saying That's called you, accuracy. This is how I see you. Okay. No Th this, this is why you're not rank one in Overwatch. Saying, you don't have the accuracy five, that you, you need. You have small hands. You can't hold it. You don't got enough hand muscle. No, that just feels weird. Asmund Gold is betrayed. Doing that? Doing that? I, what's this? That feels better to eat the sandwich like that. It's a better experience. He's wrong. Wow, He's that dumb, actually works. a piece of shit, and deserves okay. to die. <laughs> Because you're skilled, Booney. There you go. Wait, what happened here? I missed it. it Yo, how many people does he have playing with him? Holy oh, shit! 
somebody's betrayed. You can't hold it. You don't got enough hand muscle. He's Has too good for Overwatch. Betrayed and building his house. Wait, He'd this? be rank one. Wow, uh, that actually works. Okay. I want to, but I can't really get the game to play well on my stream. It was like lagging my whole stream. I think I've got it to work, but I'm going to do it solo because multiplayer, it was just like, I could, like, no matter what I did, it was like in lagging my entire stream. But, uh, single player, I could get it to work. Okay, I think we're going to try it again tonight. Uh, I'm not, I'm Jojo on Aiden Ross. Yeah, I tried yesterday, just I couldn't get it to work. The JoJo's Aiden, popping off against Aiden. And I do think that is a game that I would rather start off playing on my own. Like, getting to know the game myself. W Aiden, facts, bro. And like, Aiden, do bro. a run with some friends it's, it's w in the Aiden, you know what, bro? He owned up that he was wrong for but shooting I'd, even if I audience. wanted to, I, we wouldn't be able to. W Aiden, man, that was, the, that was the main point of my W Aiden. I'm very proud of you, bro. That's fire. Wait, what? You can main point streaming pro. What is this? Uh, I'm not- I'm Jojo on Aiden Ross. That'd Jojo's Aiden? popping Facts, off against Aiden. W Aiden? Facts, bro. W Aiden, bro. That's Common Aiden, ass Aiden, you know what, bro? <laughs> he owned up that he was wrong for streaming porn to his audience. W Aiden, man. That was the- that was the main point of my sh W Aiden. I'm very proud of you, bro. That's fire. And I hope you can learn from this, bro. And again, no hate to you personally, because I don't know you, motherfucker. Neither do I, and, and, and I don't want to know you. I don't want to know you. Know you. Ego me. I didn't know who, who. I didn't know who JoJo was. Well, you know now. <laughs> Big man's oil breaks. What was the context like? of that clip? I'm... JoJo on Aiden Ross. Why? He, why is he using a Hassan clip to for this? Why didn't he just play the JoJo clip? I was thinking Hassan was gonna have some take. I know that you tried to ego me. I didn't know who, who I didn't know who JoJo was. Well, you know now. <laughs> Big man's oil breaks bed. It would look like. Oh no. Damn. Broke the fucking. Wait, does he play bass? Don't worry about that. Don't worry about does Zoyo play bass? Oh Squeak. shit, he plays the bass. That doesn't look like me. I don't understand why people have been saying I look like a bowling ball. All right. Okay, I'm no, tired, so I'm full back asleep. Thing. I had to wake up and say hello to my favorite co-host slash yep, streamer. My co-host Bodhi, sleep well. You get that beauty sleep. Does that look? I look like a bowling ball. It's one to one. No, shut the hell up. That doesn't look like me. So stupid. Bowling balls aren't even alive. Oh my god, Maya he does. I can kind of see it because that's the sound his forehead makes when he polishes it. Sorry, I was being rude for no reason with the last. Good night, message. everyone else except Ramen. Oh, oh my god, Ramen's gonna beat you up. Bald caught it. Maya gets confused. Maya squeaks because that's the sound his forehead makes when he polishes it. I don't trust this guy. He has no hair. It's weird. Oh, okay. Joking. Whatever. Love you to Ramen. Good night. Sorry, Stinky. I was being rude for no reason. There you go. The Good night, Bodhi. The bald comments, I think, were all directed at Squeaks for the record, and I won't apologize for those. Squeaks That's is bald. fair. Squeaks is so bald. Really? Yeah. Wait, I thought Squeaks was like, like a. I thought he was like 17. I thought he was like a kid. <laughs> He's like 45. Yeah, what the really? fuck? Good night, yeah. buff stanky body in a band Wait, box. Wait, am I getting mixed up with him? What? Yep, very confused. I thought confused. he was a Minecrafter. Yeah, you're getting him mixed up with like Wantap. Squeaks doesn't even know how to play Minecraft. Nope. What does he do? Yo, that's the same. I don't even know how to play Minecraft. Plays Mario. Fuck, dude, that's bad. Oh. The only game he had as a teenager. Wait, who's... I, I remember when we first played Minecraft a couple months ago, I was sitting there like trying to figure out how to craft stuff in my inventory and I wasn't like at the workbench and I was like, why can't I see all this crafting stuff? It's not even crafting. And I like wasn't at the work. I was so confused. Like what is it, like sap nap? Who's, who's but I was asking Minecraft? people I was playing with. I was like, look at my screen. Why am I not seeing the crafting stuff? And nobody was telling me like, oh, it's because you're not in the, the, the workbench or whatever. Snap nap. Snap a nap.
If you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to we drop tried. a like. No, you did it. Keep up with the latest news. I figured it out on my own. Subscribe and turn notifications on, and I'll see you guys in the next one. You like that? You like that? Oh, life's a little oh, yeah, isn't it? I don't care if I use all my ammo. I'm gonna use a utility knife on you. That's how petty I am. Come on. <laughs> one shotted. Rest in peace. No, we did. Lies. Lies. Okay, let's look at live stream fails really quickly, and then we're playing game day. I mean, I wanted to get to this like 30 minutes ago. Um. Let's see. We'll watch a couple game day clips because who knows if we're going to watch the whole thing. We might skip around and that means we might miss some of the good moments. Whatever makes you happy. Oh, sick. Whatever you want. Whatever I want. So fucking special. So fucking special. Wish I was special. We knew Caroline could sing, but man, Tectone's voice at the OTK thing, so good. Oh, listen to that. Oh, that gave me chills. I hate this fucking song, and that gave me chills. It's like the worst Radiohead song that exists. Yeah, that was badass. <laughs> that was, that was really badass. Good. That was good really shit. Good. That was sick. Fuck yeah, dude. Hey, Jack, we were locked the fuck in. Yeah, that harmony they hit at the end. Ooh, I got. I kind of want to hear it again. I'm being real. That was good. What the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here. Dante is asked to not. Okay, we saw that. Mizkiff tackles Rafflegator, who falls and breaks his elbow and needs surgery. Are you serious? Games. Mizkiff picks it up. Rafflegator can't clear. Uh oh. He sees what he's got. He sees what he's got. This is his moment. This is where he gets to. Okay, he just kicks it over to. He sure Cypher. Over to Cypher, and then Cypher kicks it. Oh, we just Ooh. missed. Oh, oh, no, we got oh. a Miz, Miz with the assist oh, no. to Asfand. He says, hey, yo, I'm actually oh, on your team. Fuck. God damn it, dude. <sighs> Why, dude? Every game day, somebody gets hurt. Oh, my God. Wait, I didn't realize the monitor I just bought didn't have the mounting holes in the back, so that's a side. Oh, so the one you currently have. Are you cool with that? It, like, does it matter? Are you going to, like, f do you feel like using the new one as your main monitor isn't going to be as good as your other one? Or is it better? Yeah, Miz is a walking death trap. Bro, what the fuck? But, no, it's, like, every single time. Like, uh, Russell hurt himself when they were playing baseball or, do or what was it, kickball? Um, uh, E-Rob tackled Emeru when they were playing soccer last time. I'm pretty sure somebody else got hurt during one of the game day events. It it's just bad. I still love game day though. Russell gets his revenge on Rob after he breaks his arm. Oh yeah, fuck. yeah. Rob's on his on the ground with a broken arm in total pain. No. Russell remembering this from a year That's ago. Definitely an oh shit. Is that what Rafflegator did to Russell? Oh my God! Russell remembering this from I don't a year ago. That. True. From across the field. That's awesome, Sizzle. I, I need to see a, <laughs> a humongous a side slide monitor. Tackle. Hey. The slide tackles are leaked. Is, is, uh, is I mean, what you could you could return the one you got and get a different one, but yeah. that is a grudge. That is a, cool that is it. not nice. That dude. is a grudge. Chad, he, Russell held a grudge. Wait, hold on, I didn't see Russell that is a, do it. Yeah. That is a grudge. Time out. Miss Kim just got put in timeout. Yeah. That is a grudge. I didn't see Russell do it. Slide tackle, cause slide tackles are leak. Slide tackle. I need to see a replay to know. I need to see a replay to know if it was a clean slide tackle. Oh, did Russell run over there to go do that? Is, uh, is, is Rob okay? Huh? We'll, we'll Miss Kim just got put in timeout. Yeah. That is a grudge. Ms. That is a, that is not. In that is a grudge. Chad, he Russell held a grudge for an entire year, all for that one moment. <laughs> What an actual fucking dick. Oh, looks a lot bigger as a vertical. Damn, it's... Oh, there you go. Um, 
Twitch partner John Zerka has been banned. Oh, nice, dude. Let's see. He's going to be on kick, right? Uh, good. Please, John Zerka, go away. He's the guy that when I was live streaming at TwitchCon, I walked past him and he asked how many viewers I had and then he uh, promoted himself. He like came up to my camera and was like, Twitch.tv says John Zerka. And I was like, what a fucking leech, bro. I have like 10 viewers right now. Like, what a weirdo. But he's uh he's like the he's like a red pill dude on Twitch. He t constantly talks about being red pilled and weird shit like that. He's cringe. Update on Rafflegator's injury. Oh no. Elbow is broken in three places. I need to get surgery. Safe to say, no stream tonight. Hi, my Kiffy. Fuck. Yeah, now I'm a dick. If it was perfectly fine, you would have said it's a, like you didn't do anything bad. But now I'm a dick because your show because it, it's broken, huh? Oh, God. Okay, oh, that well. sucks, dude. Summit and teammate share the most insane double kill. I'm gonna be real. I might oh, he download. He just went in this warehouse. He just again. went in this warehouse. The zombie we might just try some Daisy. Okay. You whispering? He went in that door right there. Yeah, we yeah. Might uh, try it again. Okay. Wreck. What? We both shot the other guy. No fucking way. We there both shot the other guy. That's insane that we just did that. Love Daisy. Uh, I like. There's times where I love it, and then there's times where I'm just like so bored I want to uninstall it. But like when I watch people like Summit and Shroud and then play, I'm like, oh, okay, I can have some fun with that game again. Advertising. No, did not want to the flow camera. There. Yeah, I'm gonna be oh. honest. I lost my train of thought halfway through that. I was thinking about the oh. way. Oh. <laughs> and we're down to three cameras now. Okay. Oh, e Rob. Miss Kiff has now injured two women and a camera. Oh no. Miss Kiff is. All right, all right. There we go. There e Rob the Wait, what was Peach Jars freaking out for? Oh no. That's cool that Peach right, is playing right, in this. I'm e excited to watch this. Here, let's get through these clips. I want to watch this now. XUC calls himself trash without knowing. I'm good. Don't care. Um, train wrecks on kick streamers over exaggerating kicks TOS. Okay. Let's hear. I had a serious talk with him, right? That shit's not allowed. He does that shit again. You understand there will be a serious uh, consequence, if not a, a full ban. You understand? When Aiden pulled up porn, I and other. Uh, uh, people at kick higher ups shoot him the fuck out that can't happen okay the reason why that can't happen is because it's illegal and he knows that a lot of these younger communities and these streamers that are exaggerating on stream about no tos and i'm not talking about the uh twitch or youtube streamers i'm talking the kick streamers themselves i don't know if that's coming from insecurity uh, um, about a platform switch i don't know if that's coming from their fear of losing viewers, they're purposely hyping it up by saying wild shit. But that shit ain't true. You understand? There is a difference between freedom speech and hate speech. There is a very clear difference. Okay? And we're talking with those communities. Except are, a lot of people that use hate speech try to say that it's free speech. We're sitting there just blatantly using a hard R together, a uh, hard R with each other. Um, okay. Interesting. We'll see what happens with that. Um, I think Trainwreck is just being smart. He knows that that shit is illegal and that the more it goes on, his website will just get shut down. So, Hopefully they do implement some actual like TOS that says people can't do that stuff. I don't think there is a TOS that says that. At least a couple weeks ago when we read it and Moist Critical was talking about it, there wasn't. So... Um, yep, use it as shield. Yeah, shield. Yeah, exactly. Free speech. Yep, exactly. Um, okay, we saw this. Saw that already. Okay, let's watch the uh, the game day. I got to go to the bathroom real quick. Okay, it's going to start in eight seconds. Okay, I'll be right back.
Well, 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 back at it again, gentlemen. Thank you very much for joining us for another season of OTK Game Day. Today, me, Asmongold, I am going to be hosting the uh, the show along with BJP. Welcome to the show. How you doing, man? Thanks, Asmongold. I'm doing great. Excited to see another season of OTK Game Day. Oh, I am too. I mean, this is, uh, I remember the last one, I was always worried every week that they were going to call me up to have to go out there. But luckily, I just get to sit here in my room. I just got up like maybe 20 minutes ago, like probably five minutes before we started rehearsing this. And I'm ready to get this done. I'm excited, man. I am. And before we get into it, I do want to say that this whole thing has been made possible, of course, guess by who? by Starforge Systems, the best PCs in the universe, gentlemen. So you can check that out at StarforgeSystems.com. And we have to go through, and there's a number of things we need to talk about today on top of that, too. And it's not just going to be, obviously, this is the first episode. We're talking about soccer right now. But there's going to be a number of ep other episodes after that. And so I'd like to take you guys through what you have to look forward to. We have soccer today. That's February 24th. And then I think a week after that is probably going to be like March 3rd or something like that, which is going to be basketball. And then after that is softball, which I don't really know what the difference between softball and baseball is. So I probably won't be casting that one. And then we got football on March 24th. You excited? I'm so excited. I tell you, I think it's a good lineup. They uh, added a new sport this season with softball, yeah. so that'll be a little different. Uh, basketball was great last year. Soccer was great last year. Oh, yeah. Uh, and then adding football, finishing off with football this year as well. So that's something new, too. Oh, yeah. I'm excited to see the football one. I think that's the one I'm I, like. I'm glad they're saving the best for last. So. Now, to be fair, we got to be fair to our, to so our EU viewers. A lot of people think today. Racks. If he gets hit with like his website getting taken down by like the federal government for like distributing porn to minors or something, like, that's football, gonna be so we got oh, really yeah, bad. I, like, like, I was just thinking yeah, about that, I man. Like, all about them. What a bad we thing to on your reputation. Thousands of folks. Dude, they're already fucking bad. Fuck, yeah, dude, that's why he was so angry. Well, we gotta in that talk clip. a about the rules. That's why he was so like, yo, this has to stop. And how he wasn't even like talking about Twitch streamers. He's like, these kick streamers. It's going to fit together uh we got obviously two 20 minute halves guys listen i know obviously you know like the professional games are longer but here's the thing good night These sizzle people play sleep well man i'm glad living, you got your so monitor it's going to be two 20 minute halves we'll, uh, on top of a 10 minute halftime and like realistically it's probably going to be like 13 and a half minutes and, and then fuck around and find out exactly unlimited exactly. timeouts so what that is called and referred to in the business here of streaming is stalling so that's what we've got going on i'm excited People for sleep. it there's gonna be a lot of stalling a lot well of dude fun. and uh honestly a safety we've... factor asman because there oh, are no oh. professional athletes on this field today so those for those that don't know bjp can come in handy when that's someone's out of breath, uh soda pop and step brother have a stroke so yeah. um so we're gonna have one every 30 and, uh, seconds so, he's there yeah, he's a lawyer he's like I'm everybody's so lawyer and uh we got I, I don't even know how many people we got going on but we have a whole lot of people ready i i don't even know i think it's like like 15 20 i think people i counted 16 like i met him right, at twitchcon yeah, i went up and talked to him on stream God, eight people they need oh wait no i think that was when my stream cut yeah, out and i was just do. recording I mean, from honestly, my phone i just i, I got screenshots with him though well not not like somebody gets hurt looks like esports joe rogan let's talk about actually who is going to be playing today true number one <laughs> we got our first contestant our first player yes. is going to he's be wearing the red. same kind of like shirt joe rogan Everybody would wear too her. it's just not as she juice tons of cooking not as strings. juice she's only showed up because she thought this was a spot oh really oh wow okay that's that's you know, only showed up she thought this and was a also, sponsored stream uh, nmp's wait what did that say might not know this but uh nmp's favorite person here thought soccer was made up a uh, sport by the government it seems like a good idea okay. and it's also uh like I, booney I said football this, but, uh, it's actually nick's favorite person. sorry i missed that for a minute so booney, my she bad is. hybrid how you doing she can't hear me because she doesn't have yeah she has no idea what yeah, i'm no saying roids oh, rogan. Wow. actually right it when i opened up tiktok though. earlier i, I, I saw a yeah, tiktok oh, about yeah. joe rogan yeah. talking about but what roids is on can we okay. watch that real quick here? Let's watch that. Let's just see now that we're on that topic. Real quick. I we'll know you were to supposed this. to be in Batgirl. I guess that project went away, but. Yeah. Oh. Joe, what's yeah. everything you take? Everything. Tyler said, oh, wait, what? Joe, what's yeah. everything you take? 
Everything. Everything. That was well, sexual. Most of, nah, it, nah, most of it is like the, the big results come from testosterone replacement. Mm -hmm. So there's that. And then that's something that Hassan is going to start doing eventually. Like Hassan has talked about himself. Like once he gets into like his late 30s, he's going to start doing testosterone replacement. There's peptides that increase your body's ability to grow uh, hormones, like growth hormone and IGF-1. What peptides? There's uh, peptides. Oh, human growth hormones. See, that shit is scary because it, like, makes your heart bigger. So, like, a lot of people will think they're, like, extending their life, but then they end up dying of, like, heart diseases because of that shit. That's Man, how a lot of people uh, Yeah, there's BBC-157, and there's another now thing. What? So now what? Now what? Common no. as BBC. You know? I think but it's I'm called Google it later. <laughs> You've Googled BBC. Uh, I'm, no, I'm I don't think Sin is in uh, Another the one's the called Thymus. Game day. And what these things do is they... Uh, they help your body produce oh, wait, really? Was the she? hormones Maybe. that it should have when you're younger. There were younger some special guests. And your body works better. Hmm. And if you do that... And, and you... actually, somebody had to drop wake or something. Had to drop out. So I think they had somebody had to replace them. So you could be right. You regularly exercise. That's the biggest thing. Really? If there's ever one thing that someone can do to stop aging, it's lift weights. And don't stop. And don't do it for vanity. Do it because you want to keep your tissue. Like, think of it as, like, age is like a little demon that's slowly robbing you of your tissue. Yep. Your ability to I think that's like stairs, Rich. I'm pretty sure Rich Pina, that guy, that one bodybuilder, Freud guy, and that, didn't he die from, like, heart shit, to too? Open like, jars, your ability oh, yeah, to open dude, a car door. It, it, that's all, yeah. Seriously, it, he didn't just get those arms just from lifting weights. Like, l go look at Joe Rogan clips of him in his early 20s when he was like just starting out and stand up and stuff like that he was a skinny dude very skinny dude like he didn't get these arms just from lifting weights he had like i'm sh like the growth hormones did that when it's frozen he was on everything all yeah, that shit is, real. is awful and for the sure only way to i agree with what he's saying though about like increasing the longevity uh, longevity of life by keeping your muscle tissue good because like over time that stuff does deteriorate yeah, is but, weightlifting. But yeah, you have once to it gets to a point where you're lift. like taking all these drugs, illegal drugs, things like that, just so you like like the way your body looks. It's like fuck. Heavy things, and you have to. You don't want to do anything too heavy where you hurt yourself, but you want to get your body accustomed to this idea that in order to survive, it has to lift things, and you need to give that body nutrients. I, I, don't I agree. Care if you but... like lift your own body, your body's heavy. You can do chin ups and push ups and body squats. That's all great stuff. You don't need to lift heavy weights in terms of your your own body is assuming at least 100 pounds that's pretty fucking heavy when i do kettlebells i don't do anything heavier than 70 pounds for the most part mm. that's the heaviest shit i ever lift mm. so it's mostly just full body motion that makes your body know that this is a 